What has happened to BC Spirits? BC Spirits, Spirit Day number 358. Today is something I haven't actually had on the show ever. I've never tasted it, never had it on the show, and so it's brand new to me. Um, it is the Arbutus Distilling Double Barrel uh, Canadian Single Malt. So this is their Single Malt Whiskey, three years in, three plus years in American Oak uh, ex bourbon barrels, and then finished in a number four char virgin oak barrel. Um, and so very, very, like the virgin oak thing, I know that Ripple Rock at uh, Shelter Points, Ripple Rock has got virgin oak. Virgin oak is something fantastic to me, especially if you get a really heavy char to it, because you get these beautiful vanilla toffee and caramel notes. Um, and that's what this one is testifying to. So I'm really looking forward to tasting this one because you know how much I love my whiskey. I've got tons of whiskey on the back bar. Do I need more? I probably do. I probably could use some more. Um, so I love Arbutus. I think Michael is a very, very talented distiller. Um, oh, there we go. It's at the very bottom of it as a different sticker. Okay. Let's give this a nose. Funky and fruity grain notes on the nose. Definitely get that single malt straight off the hop. I want to give a swirl. She's been stuck in a bottle for a bit. She needs to open up. It starts off really fruity and grain forward on the front of the palate, and then it really leans into those vanillas, those toffees, those caramels. All this is still very light, almost, I'm gonna say lowlandish style. If you're gonna try and align it with a, a, a single malt from the from Scotland, that's what most people do. It's very lowland style, cut grass, fresh, ro uh, fresh pet uh, flowers, hillsides, that sort of thing. Very, very fresh. Fruity with hints of that toffee and caramel and vanilla. Balanced and complex. The grain is definitely forward and fruitiness. Very almost musty, husky grain to it. But then it balances out really nicely with those really deep caramels and chocolates. Fantastic little single malt. Can't really say much about that. Like for a collection, good to go. The Arbutus Canadian Single Malt, double barrel aged. Thanks as always for the support, guys. Bye.